Well, all right. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of YouTube. Pastor Dow here. Well, I have a very interesting video here um, that I'm actually making right now. And what we're going to do is tomorrow we have a show that comes on, I think it's uh, 6 p.m. Central Standard Time called Hold Fast Wednesdays. It'll be on this channel right here on YouTube. And um, apparently it says in the title right here, somebody by the name of Biblical Education has 4,300 subscribers. He puts a title down there and says, Pastor Gino calls Pastor Dow the enemy of God. I'm actually going to link the video down here in the description. And hey, if you have two hours to listen to it, but I think you'll get plenty after the first 20 minutes, please go listen to it. Now, it still stands to reason, and it's a fact, that Jennings said that he would debate anyone. That's what he said. And now he's crawdadding, he's backpedaling, and he's saying he's making the accusation that all that we want is a show. No, all I'm doing is answering your loudmouth call. That's all I'm doing. And um, so watch this. So now he's up there peacocking and tap dancing around all to avoid the debate platform, a real true professional debate platform. I mean, if you really want to know what a show was, go and look at the time that he debated the homosexual. Go and look at the time he debated a Rastafarian. And go look at the time he debated another guy in Jamaica that had some kind of crazy stuff. That, that was a show. And then he eventually, and when, he, you know, when you're on this platform, uh, then he eventually just you have security to escort you out and, pick, and put you out. The reason why I'm calling for a professional moderated debate is so that we can have a civil conversation. Because if you don't know the scriptures... You, don't, you wouldn't even know exactly what this wizard is doing. And I feel sorry for a lot of you people up there who don't have the mental aptitude to actually search the scriptures for yourself. I, I, it's amazing to me how that he only goes to a certain uh, text in the New Testament while avoiding everything else. And, and, you know, listen, if you're trying to define what truth is based on only the New Testament alone, you're going to be deceived. And you won't know what hits you when, when somebody like this is preaching. But that's the reason why the book says the blind lead the blind. They both, fo both fall into the ditch. Then he plays on the public sentiment by saying certain things that has always been offensive in church doctrine, but he never goes to the scripture to, to define it. Never. Or either the guy who's put the video together. It's actually very deceitful. It's all, you know what it is? It's actually bewitchment. This man is a wizard and a witch. He's, he's bewitching the people of Yah. And so Pastor Dow said, hey, I'm a man. I accept your challenge. See what happens when a real man calls out a male? See what I mean? He's willing to debate and scream and holler at everybody else. But when a real man comes knocking at his door to answer his loudmouth call, all of a sudden, nowhere to be found. So tomorrow night. 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. Uh, we're going to carefully go over a few of these accusations that he's making because, uh, again, he's not going to face me. He's not going to do it. He's going to continue to keep come up with excuses and dodging. And I can't see how some of you people up there in First Church and even here on the Internet, I can't understand why you can't even see how disingenuous he are. Why is it okay for him to throw disparaging comments and, and make up lies and rhetoric? I guarantee he cannot produce the person that he said that has cussed him out and called him all kind of MF. That's called theatrics. That's called theater. I guarantee he can't produce it. He cannot produce it. He's just talking. He's speaking. See, what I did was pull his card. And I'm letting you all see how false he is. And, of course, tomorrow, if you choose to be here, you're going to hear the word rightly divided. We're going to use the whole book to define what truth is. So I hope to see y'all here tomorrow, 6 p.m. Central Standard Time, on Hold Fast Wednesdays. Let the elders speak. So y'all have a wonderful day. And listen, I'm telling y'all, man, um, he's got some, some of y'all up under some major bewitchment. See, it ain't what he is saying. It's what he's not saying. It's what he's not putting in there. He's, it's, it's, it's what he's ignoring and what he's dodging. I mean, he is just using that word. Whoa, boy, what a manipulator. And I'm going to prove it. I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to actually show y'all. Then I'm going to include another video below that 
about another man that I've never met before. And he actually calls it out and tells everybody what Geno Genesis is actually doing. So if you choose to listen, listen, but here it is. All right, have a wonderful day.